Hey everybody, it's Nathan Walters here, music producer, recording artist, and former boy band member. If you're new to my channel, I was in a band on Atlantic Records back in the day called Plus One. We sold over a million records and toured the world. These days I'm producing records, singing songs, and going down the rabbit hole of BTS, really. I know I've been doing some reaction videos to different K-pop songs, sometimes some American pop songs. But um, I'm, I see this growing community. I'm so thankful for all of you, all of the comments. Uh, I'm just kind of fanning out together with you and learning more and more about BTS, and I'm loving every moment. So I was about to do a personal viewing of Jungkook in Times Square uh, just by myself. S someone in the comments said I should check out the Times Square performance. I thought, oh, I'll just check that out. And then I started to watch it, and I was like, what am I doing? I should be filming this. This is the whole point. So I'm going to watch this with you guys. I want you to see my reaction. I'm familiar with the song. I've already done a review to his or reaction to his official music video, which I thought was so cool. Uh, and I want to see what it's like live. So let's dive in. I got my favorite tea ready to go and everything's queued up. Jungkook at Times Square live. Let's go. Hey, New York City. Standing next to you. Cool. I uh, can always get to see the energy of the crowd. <laughs> Oh, it's so fun. And, and listening to my headphones, you hear it in stereo. It feels like you're right there. Oh, this is fun. Okay. Uh, I thought for a second there he's about to do like that move that Michael Jackson does on uh, the dangerous, uh, I don't know if it's the dangerous, it was MTV performance back in the day. I don't know what year. It, dangerous. Dangerous. Um, he did that whole move. It seems similar what about he was about to do, but he didn't go into it. But it was a nice little shout out. I've already addressed that this is definitely Michael, like an homage to Michael Jackson, which is, I, I love Michael Jackson. So. Here we go. That, that right there. Standing next to you. I love that bass. I play slow. I push up on this funk and give me miracles. Making on. I will let the ride is something we control. Hey, you know that. I scream me to testify. Come. That's cool with the they microphone. I'm gonna hold off. Okay, um, I like how he's playing. Like he's letting the track go. You hear some of the background vocals that are on there. He's not shy of that. It's like that's a thing, you know. Michael Jackson really used to really lip sync. You know, no one cared because he's up there dancing, performing, and you know, so great. I think he probably lip sang more than we th we know. I'm not saying Michael Jackson couldn't sing. We all know he could sing. But there's nothing wrong with, with kind of letting the performance take place when you're singing and dancing. But that being said, I know BTS and Jungkook, he's obviously singing live right now. You can hear that. But I like how he's not ashamed to like be quiet, let the crowd sing, let his vocals take over in the track. Um, and I like that, like I said, I like that choreography uh, move with the, with the microphone right there. That's cool. Cool. Here us go. They can divide us rest of yeah. You know it's deeper than the rain, it's deeper than the pain, but it's deep like DNA, something they can take away. Hey, take, 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 take off. Yeah. Standing next to you. Cool. Cool. Okay. Alright, I'm enjoying this. Um what was I gonna say? Okay, uh oh I had a thought. I got distracted. Oh I was first I was gonna say there's so much choreography. It's a little overwhelming. Like I'm trying to put myself in that position. I'm like, gotta learn all that dancing and stuff. And uh they're doing a great job, obviously. Um but I love oh yeah, I, I'm just reminded, I've already said this before. I like that this song is not your conventional chorus structure. 
it's like you're you're in this song and right when you feel like you think you know what the chorus is you're down a whole nother melodic musical journey i've used on another i've said before and it just kind of sucks you in and then yeah, the payoff is standing next to you you know just kind of chilling which which feels like a post chorus to me which i love i love how it's it's different than uh than an expected uh chorus normal chorus structure okay let's just let's keep going and I love the snare of that drum kit. Afterglow, leave your body cold and like the sun in the moon. Cool. Hey. I love this part. Come on, let's go. Oh, there's a drone on stage. Oh, that's cool. That's how they're getting their shots. Oh, that's cool. I didn't even think of that until I saw that drone flying on stage. That's cool. That way there's no cameraman coming in there messing up the visual for the audience. What a, I love that that's happening. We live in such a great world with technologies advancing that now the people in the audience can really enjoy the show and don't have to worry about a cameraman up there. Because a lot of times... You know, when you're watching on TV, you're you're loving it. But if you're in the audience, you're like, oh, the cameras are in the way. There's a bulky guy with a camera and the person holding the cord, making sure he doesn't trip over it. Here, you can enjoy the performance. That's cool. That's the first time I've seen that. Cool. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. <laughs> That's cool. Who's that? Mac Mike putting the mic down now. Oh yeah, they're gonna do like some breakdown. Here we go. Oh cool. I love those background vocals and those horns. Who would put horns in a track today? Yeah! <laughs> the crowd loves that too. All right, there's the Michael shout out. Oh, straight up Michael there. Cool. All right. Yeah, that's awesome. And the energy of the crowd. So cool. I like those earrings. <laughs> He's like, come on, let me hear you. Oh, that's cool. He seems like such a nice guy. <laughs> All right. I'm tempted, I'm tempted to keep watching. Yeah. I'll save this for another time. Okay, thank you, for, thank you for watching that with me. If you have any other songs you want me to check out, please put them in the comments. I, I go through and have a list that I'm going through and, and trying to see which ones make sense for me to do. Also, check out my live cover, or my live, yeah, it was live, but my cover of one of the BTS songs, uh, it's called Fake Love. Actually, speaking of, at the recording of this video, it's coming out this Friday on all the streaming stores, you know, Apple, Spotify, Amazon, all that. A lot of people have said, hey, I want to add it to my Spotify. Now you can this Friday. All right, make sure you like, subscribe, share this with others, and uh, I'll see you next time.